In Olkaria's geothermal fields, we found two women who have pioneered the practice of geological and technical engineering in Kenya. Brenda Nyota and Teresa Karani have risen through the ranks to become the cornerstones of the drilling and technical services in the geothermal plants here, a field dominated mostly by men. We spoke to Brenda and Teresa on what it takes to be at the core of the electricity generating process at Olkaria. My name is Brenda Nyota. I have uh, worked here for five years. I'm a drilling engineer, and uh, this is what I do daily. Behind you is a rig um, the, that is used to drill geothermal wells, and uh, my day-to-day -day job is supervising and coordinating the drilling of that well. We have a team currently that is uh, pulling out of hole. Um, that means uh, removing the pipes out of hole after drilling. They've currently drilled up to 2,000 meters. I've uh, covered a number of wells, uh, close to 20. Yes, I've uh, managed to supervise the drilling of uh, close to 20 wells. I do both office work and uh, field work. So I start at the office. I uh, look at the reports, what has been going on. The, uh, I compile that, and then I come to the field. So through the field, I get a brief of what is happening from uh, the rig superintendent. And uh, then I get to tour around the rig, find out what is happening. I, in case there's a challenge, we get to address that. I was the only lady in my class, and the men there were very supportive. Uh, actually, I would like to encourage all the women who want to join a technical field. Uh, do not be afraid that uh, there are few ladies. Men ha are very, have along the way become very supportive. I joined Kenjen as a graduate engineer 14 years ago. I've risen through the ranks to the post of assistant manager, technical success. Mainly what I do for Kenya from day to day is that uh, I resolve plant problems. It may be breakdowns or various equipment have failed. I do automation projects. I do rehabilitations and upgrades of equipment and systems. Uh, it is exciting to work uh, with men as well as women. You find that um, uh, the synergy when you work with uh, both genders, everybody has a contribution to make. So it is uh, basically it is just like any other team. Eh? The biggest challenge that I have faced 31st of December, we were just preparing to, to go for New Year celebrations when suddenly a fault occurred in the plant and actually caused a nationwide blackout. We had to stay back for about 36 hours to resolve that problem, which we successfully did. I would encourage the young girls outside there, somebody who feels inspired and think that they can do engineering, I want to confirm to them that it is exciting, it's fulfilling, it is paying. I would ask them to study engineering and finally pursue to become professional engineers.